Hi everyone, uh, this is Satrujit from Digital Shastra. Welcome back to my channel. So, uh, if you don't know what this channel is all about, basically I uh, do a lot of digital marketing and entrepreneurship related videos. Then uh, I also provide tips and tricks to grow businesses online. And I also do uh, reviews of softwares, hostings and plugins and a lot of tools that you can use to leverage uh, your work uh, or your business. So basically today I'm going to show you uh, my personal review on Hostinger and why I personally feel that this is the best available hosting for WordPress and for personal blog, for personal branding, for small websites, for portfolio websites, for blogging and you name it and uh, you got it from Hostinger and the best thing is uh, they really provide you a lot of value at a very low price and uh, they really have a nice interface. If you are a non-coder, if you don't know how to code, you can simply go to Hostinger and start working uh, for a few uh, for a, a new website or for a blog or for a a funnel or for a landing page or anything you are willing to start so let's uh, dig deeper into this video normally I will go into the dashboard I will show you that I have purchased a lot of domain and hostings from this website and apart from that I will also show you how we can create or uh, install a WordPress and SSL into a website within uh, five minutes so let's get started so first of all there are a lot of web hosting uh, plans available here so one is single in here you will get one website one email limited bandwidth of 100 gb then you have this is unlimited plan where you can uh, add unlimited hostings and the bandwidth will be unlimited as well and they will also give you free ssl then uh, there is a business web hosting that also has unlimited number of websites unlimited emails unlimited bandwidth free ssl uh, certificate and domain and daily backups and 4x allocated resources that means your site or your website will be quite faster because uh, a lot of resources will be allocated uh, to this plan so basically I have this plan with me so there are a lot of few uh, features if you expand this drop down which you don't have in this middle one and uh, the reason why I have this uh, hosting plan is because I have a lot of blogs running on it uh, then I have plans to create a lot of blogs in the future I also have few client websites on this hosting so that uh, I can add unlimited clients into it because uh, if you go with this kind of hostings it won't be that fast and uh, it is always easy to add more and more websites because your client will be paying you money uh, for their uh, retaining services so it is not a big deal to get this one if you are doing some business so if you are a starter you can go with this or if you are a freelancer who is getting uh, income every month you can go with the middle but i would suggest this one because see once if you are serious about a business if you are serious about a, a blog or if you are serious about some venture you should always go with the best because unlimited traffic speed fast opening these things really matter right so let's say you are targeting a keyword that that is having millions and millions of traffic but when you when you use these kind of hostings your website will be slow and it will be like crashing every uh, now and then so i would prefer this one so let's uh go inside the panel just click login you have to create an account i have created mine it is really easy you can log in through facebook log in through google so this is one thing that i really love about them that i don't see uh, with so many other hosting providers now click on this link like uh, I have uh, 
the account with digitalshatra.com so i will cl- click on that so now i am at the dashboard of hostinger okay you can see uh, i have one hosting over here which is unlimited hosting it expires on 2024 i have taken it for 4 years so basically uh, the more a length you add into a validity like 4 years 6 years or 10 years uh, the cheaper the hosting is for you so basically i would suggest you to go for a 4 years or 3 years or 2 years or do not go for 1 year because when you renew the hosting the charges are quite high so uh, you can see i have five domains added up here in the dashboard these are the domains i have let's say i will add this domain to my hosting just copy the domain name and click on manage so i have clicked on manage i'm showing you how quickly you can add a website and uh, make it ready to go with a uh, ssl certificate as well so just go down below to auto installer again uh here you can see all the websites that are currently running on wordpress these are the four websites these are already running on wordpress so what i will do is i will click on hosting again click on add a website i will just click add a website then i will paste the name i have pasted the name it is free job alert dot site i have uh, my password here because i have uh, last pass connected to this then i will click on add website created successfully so now you have your website inserted into the hosting panel so now i will show you here you can see free job alert that site this is the website so now i will click here in the manage now on the left side on the drop down you can click and you can see the free job alert that site is available in the hosting panel so once you click on free job alert that site uh then you have to go down below and click on auto installer now we are installing wordpress to free job alert dot site which is already added to the hosting panel to speak in layman language we have a hosting and we have a domain we attach the website to the hosting and now we are going to install wordpress to it wordpress is nothing but a cms which is called content management system just like uh, you are sharing content over facebook or blogger or twitter you are going to share content through wordpress so i'll click on wordpress now you can see the domain name is here all you have to do is you have to give a username and you have to give a password so this is your username and password to enter the website i mean enter here in the sense is you have to enter in the back end not in any uh, buddy's account or something like that so this will be the wordpress back end of this website i will click on install see this is quite easier so you just have to click install you can see the php version will be 5.6.2.0 which is latest required disk space is 55 mb we don't have to bother about that because this is an unlimited one so i will click on install so this this will take a few seconds like 30 to 60 seconds or something like that depending upon your internet connection so you have to be a bit patient 
because uh, a 55 MB of data will be inserted into your domain and uh, the root folder of the domain you can say the root folder which is the back end basically so so uh, if we talk about uh, hostinger why i like it a lot that is only because of this uh, this is really easy you don't have to take anybody's help you just have to do few clicks the uh, panel the dashboard is so neat and clean so now you can see the wordpress is done list of installed applications so what i will do is i will find my uh, domain there are so many domains yeah uh, so free job alert is the domain now you can uh, see the website live kaboom check pnr status live so this is another website i have so all you have to do now is to click here and get redirected uh, to the website so here is the website it is already live so basically i have to change few things uh, by mistake indeed this has taken name from another site which i can change it here so basically if you want to go to the back end just put a slash over here let's say my website is free job alert dot site just put a slash then wp then dash then admin so this is your back end just use this syntax then you will be at the back end i remember this is the username and password we selected during the installation so i will hit login <coughs> so as you can see uh, we are here at the back end the wordpress dashboard you can simply click here and visit the site uh, now mm, i will i will just uh, do some edits i will customize this so yeah the site identity mm, i will make it free job let's say free government job alerts every day stay updated with latest job info then i will click on publish now uh, i will close this and i will visit again mm, i think i have to flush the cache mm, yeah now you can see we have free government job alerts every day stay updated with latest job info as you can see uh, whatever i added to this is available here so i created this website uh, in less than 10 minutes and you can also do that so if you are willing to do a wordpress website within 10 minutes and deliver it to your clients so this is how you can do you can just do simple edits by adding few themes you can always go to the dashboard and add themes to it go to appearance then themes you can then click on add new then there are a lot of themes so you can choose any kind of theme uh, you want there are fashion related themes there are uh, sports related themes beauty related themes there are news related themes there are a lot of themes which you can select from here so some of them are free some of them are paid so decide according to your budget so uh, this was how we could use hostinger so this is what i really wanted to show you guys this is really an easy platform uh, this is not like other brands i don't want to take name or defame anyone but yeah i have used a lot of brands uh, but the problem with them is when you add a ssl certificate uh, you have to call them you have to mail them you have to take the live chat support and tell them that i want to change my ssl or i want to add my ssl uh, my website is not showing up or this is happening with my website so here things are quite transparent easy and user friendly and uh, they do have a great support uh, they have a lot of uh, pre answered questions you can also get in touch with them and uh, the best thing about this is the dashboard it is neat clean and really easy to use if you want to add new domains you can simply go to domains and add new 
if you want to uh, add new websites to your hosting you can go to hosting that are new so this is why i really love hostinger uh, normally there are a lot of youtube channels they they say names because they are affiliate and they are willing to earn some cash out of it but here you can say uh, you can see easily that i have added many websites to this uh, hosting uh, so basically i am a real life user so i am not lying to you or i don't want to cheat anyone so this is really a great platform for no brainers or non coders and you can say marketers so marketers really hate coding and really hate uh, wasting a lot of time so as a digital marketer i don't prefer wasting a lot of time so this is this is how you can use hostinger to build websites easily in few minutes and uh, yeah this was my uh, review about it so you can uh, go ahead and comment below if you need any specific review on any tool or software or any website i can go ahead and do that for you and yeah i will put a link to this website in the comment box below and yeah that will be a affiliate link where if you want to buy some hosting or domain uh, i will be getting a small amount of that uh, in commission uh, and that will keep me motivated to make new and new videos uh, for you guys so that's it thanks for watching bye bye